Okay, welcome back to Bounce Around Charleston. Well, my next guest, you know him, State Representative of District 111, Wendell Gilliard. He's here to talk about his one of his favorite subjects, Project Cool Breeze. Welcome, Representative. How you doing, sir? I'm glad to be here and always proud to be on Bounce. I, I, I really am. Okay. <laughs> okay, tell us what's happening with Project Cool Breeze 2021. Well, definitely, uh, we're definitely off to a good start. Uh, this is our 22nd year of Project wow. Cool Breeze. Uh, it just shows you uh, the, the citizens here throughout the Tri-County uh, that they really care about this project. Uh, they know the value and the things that we've been doing throughout many years, uh, and especially with your help, uh, Reverend. Well, let's, let's review and let's tell the people what motivated you to start this. Well, definitely. You know, I always tell people the story. You know, I was raised up in public housing, uh, you know, and my mom and pop always taught me uh, how to always give back. Uh, in this program, uh, it sort of amplifies and it exemplifies uh, their philosophy, the things that they instilled in me. Uh, as you well know, uh, when President Clinton was in office, we had a, a serious problem throughout the country. Uh, which we have now, believe it or not, uh, with the heat index. You know, we, we have a heat problem uh, all over the country, even to this present day. Well, back then, we had the similar problem, and it just motivated me to want to help our seniors because it had already it was a proven fact that seniors were dying in, in numbers in the hundreds and thousands. And, and here we were in the city of Charleston, as you well know, the humidity is, is, is out there, it's high. And we were, back then, uh, we were in extreme heat uh, conditions, you know? And I just got on my knees, prayed about it, uh, got up, got with some great people such as uh, Channel 5 uh, and a lot of other businesses such as Lowe's. Uh, and back then it was South Carolina Electric and Gas, but now it's Dominion, it's Boeing, it's, you know, in many other companies uh, that have joined on our bandwagon to help our seniors throughout the tri uh, So we're making a difference. But it, it was because of our seniors dying because of the high heat index that really motivated me to want to get involved, get with a good team of people. Uh, you know, we, we now have uh, Michelle Harris, who's our coordinator, Terry Boone, who's always there uh, with us and helping us, uh, and many other volunteers uh, throughout the communities, uh, you know, they all come together uh, as to help us make this happen. Even Carolyn Brown, uh, you know, she was always a cornerstone for Project Cool Breeze. Miss Cecilia Rogers, you know, I, I can't say enough about these ladies. Okay, so you've been giving away fans and air conditioners, am I correct? Yes, and just recently, believe it or not, uh, by virtue of COVID-19, we did a couple of food distributions. We had one at your church. Correct. As you can remember, uh, we had hundreds of people turn out. So yeah, we've been doing some wonderful things. Yes. So, okay, I know you're in Columbia right now, but can you think of anything to tell the public what they need to have in hand when they register for Project Cool Breeze? All you have to do is make the phone call send in your information, your basic information, your address, your age, and then you will in return receive a phone call from one of the wonderful volunteers. Uh, and once we get to it, uh, we will make sure that we fit your need. Okay, well, well, Representative Gillard, we want to tell you thank you again for Project Cool Breeze 2021. Anything else you want to tell the public? Well, well definitely, my, you know, here we are six, six years off, off of the uh, Mother Emanuel situation, and, I, and I, I'd be remiss if I didn't send a good shout out and thank you uh, to the wonderful pastor of Mother Emanuel, uh, Mr. Er Reverend Eric Manning and uh, Miss Blondell Gaston. Uh, they were wonderful. We just, we just, we're just off of the humanitarian award a couple of days. I am a recipient along with many of my other peers, including the Speaker of the House. Uh, Mr. J.B. Lucas, uh, we were recipients and we're very proud of that.
but the work goes on. We're, we're, we're not going to just take accolades, but we're going to make progress. And that's what I told Blondell Gaston and, and Reverend uh, Manny. That, that thank you for the accolades and award. We love you for it. But we're going to keep this mission. This was not a moment. This was a movement. We're going to make 3620, which is the hate crime bill, come to fruition. Okay, State Representative Wendy Gayard, District 111, Project Cool Breeze 2021. We want to say thank you for being on Bounce Around Charleston. And thank you. Thank you, Pastor. Okay. Well, you heard it right here on Bounce Around Charleston. We'll be right back after this break.